Ba -ba -da -da. I'm loving it. <laughs> uh, I think that's somebody else's catchphrase. <laughs> Good day, everybody. It's your friendly neighborhood YouTuber back at it again with another action figure review. And we're going to put together the big old monster Venom from the monster Venom build away figure that includes... Mm, Venom, Scream, Poison, I have yet to do Spider-Ham or uh, Typhoid, Typhoid Mary. I wanted to get the symbiotes uh, out, out the way. And uh, so, of course, Spider-Man is not a part of this wave. I just figure I include Spider-Man because I feel like I should include him in this wave. And also, I have my Marvel Select Anti-Venom 2, which I'm going to compare to this monster, the Marvel Legends Monster Venom, guys. So, without further ado, I'm going to push him up right here so I can put my camera right here. And we're going to assemble this Monster Venom together and we're going to see how awesome he looks. So guys, this is my first um, Build-A-Figure um, assembly <laughs> video. I don't, know, I don't know what to call this video, but uh, it's going to be called Monster Venom uh, Build-A-Figure Action Figure Review. So guys, I don't really know where to start, so I guess I'm going to start with uh, the torso of uh, Venom right here. And of course this torso and then the back piece uh, came with uh, Spider-Ham. So, let's do this. I'm guessing, okay, it pops in this way. Okay, so it snaps on like that, as you can see. So there's the torso. Pretty nice, it's pretty... Pretty lightweight, it's not that heavy so far. Uh, so let's pop on his, it would be his left arm, right? Yeah, his left arm. So I'm, I, I get confused because I'm holding his left arm in my right hand. So I'm trying not to say right, right hand. So let's pop that in there. Look at that, look how awesome he's, he looks already, guys. Okay, so let's take his right arm. <laughs> When I think right arm, I have to think left hand. So let's pop in his left arm. And they pop in very nicely too. So let's move the camera up because he's going to get a little bit bigger. That's what she said. Do -do -do. Um, yeah, he already has a nice feel to him. And he already has a nice look to him already. So there is his first half. So let's get his feet. Um in place and I'm guessing this is yeah this would be well his toe was right here so I'm guessing man my stupid fucking neighbor is cutting the grass right now if you hear a big old loud noise it's my damn neighbor on his riding lawnmower man every time I do a damn video there's always a noise outside my damn house that, keeps, that seems to drown me out so okay um, so the toe Oh wait, it says it right here. Left. So this is the left right here. No. No, because his toe... Hold on, let me look at my toes. <laughs> Hold on one minute. So my toes are in. So this would be this right here. It would be his left leg, but this would be going on to his right leg. Right? Let me match up the veins. <laughs> I can't believe it's making this, this difficult. Yeah, for some reason this says right. Okay, it's his right leg. Okay, I am right. Okay. So, let's pop in his right leg. My goodness, man. It shows you I know nothing about anatomy. So, pop. Ugh. Pop that leg in. Ugh. Like so, I'm guessing. Yeah, because this is his right leg and this would be his left. Yeah, I gotcha. So, let's pop in his right leg and his right leg is having a hard time going in so let's try this let's use some force here maybe I can turn it on there or something I don't know there we go we got it on look at that look how amazing that is oh nice nice okay so let's put his left leg on yeah left leg okay so I'll make sure I'm putting his legs on the right on the right uh, part of his body so let's move this up. His legs, his legs are pretty difficult to get on. I guess that's a good thing. 
Ugh. I feel like you guys are missing out here. Okay. So. Okay. All right. There we go, guys. All right. So here is Venom. Monster Venom, should I say. And he's missing one piece. His head, guys. Here we go. You guys ready? Let me... Let me zoom out. Really? Is this guy, like, riding, like, right next to my fucking house with his lawnmower? That fucking asshole, dude. Ugh. I hate neighbors. Don't you hate neighbors? Alright. So, we're gonna pop his head on. Like so. And there we have it, guys. We have the monster Venom. And he looks pretty freaking awesome. And, of course, his head goes up like that, so you have to get him... You can't really stand him up straight because he's looking upwards, so you're going to have to crunch him a little bit. Here is his arms. Man, this guy is badass. You know, it's weird. He does have, like, a purpleness to him. It's not a black. And the right light, I mean, it looks like a, like a, like a faded black, but it's actually like a, like a purple, a purplish. So... I think this guy next door knows I'm doing a toy review, and that's why he's driving his lawnmower right next to my window. Asshole. <laughs> so, <laughs> so here is the Monster Venom. And doesn't he look amazing, guys? He looks really, really awesome. I'm glad that I got this wave. Like I said, three out of the five figures that I recently re reviewed, they are definitely pretty awesome. I really, really like them a lot. And yeah, he's so big, it's hard for me to get him in camera. Here is the monster Venom, guys. Uh, he was definitely worth it. You know what I mean? To buy all these figures and to get this monster Venom, I think he was definitely worth it. You know, he's more than just a $20 action figure. I mean, this guy easily is like a 40 maybe 50 60 dollar action figure and of course they're selling them on ebay for like 100 uh 200 bucks you know for this monster venom uh build a figure really 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 pleased with this venom guys i really really do like him let me straighten out my camera and i'll show you the articulation that he has um of course the best articulation in the business marvel legends his arms do extend out very, very wide. His back is a little loose. So. Yeah, I do love all the veins all over his body. That's something that I wish they would have gave this Venom figure, you know, some veins. And some of these right here, I call these strings, even though it's a part of the symbiote, uh, symbiote costume. I just call them the strings because I don't want to get too technical. Very, very nice. So let's go in for a close-up, guys. Let me do, uh, let me stand him here real quick. Get my camera, and then I'll go in for a close-up. Man, he is just badass, dude. I really, really like this guy a lot. I mean, just look at, look at this, man. Look at his back. That is one big freaking spider. That's like tarantula giant tarantula style and this guy is monstrous man that's why they call him monster venom he is just monstrous look at that back dude jeez he is just badass and like i said right here they've given him these uh these tentacles uh just adds a little bit more to this figure and, of course, he does have a waist swivel here. He does have a nice break here where you can get him look down even further. Or you can have him screaming up at the sky. You want me? Come and get me. You want me? Come and get me. Uh, uh, it's very hard to scream with your tongue open. I was screaming with my tongue open, so it's much more difficult than you think. <laughs> you guys are probably trying to scream with your tongue open. Yeah, it's not that difficult. Um, of course, he has the brakes here at the upper thighs. Does he have double jointed knees? He does. Look at that, man. 
for a big action figure, they gave him double jointed knees. That's pretty awesome. Uh, somebody was complaining about when they were reviewing this figure that he had very loose legs. I'm going to tell you right now, this figure, my figure does not have loose legs. Of course, he has ankle articulation. A break here at the lower shin. So that's pretty cool. This guy is awesome. Uh, like I said, I haven't reviewed Typhoid Mary or, um, or Spider-Ham, but I can say for certain, you guys, this figure is the best figure from this wave. I can tell you right now because he is just straight perfection. He is really, really awesome. I have no complaints about this figure. He is the perfect Venom, man. He has that monstrous face. He has this tongue. He has the eyes, he has the perfect scope, the perfect body. This is the Venom that we were all kind of looking for, you know what I mean? This is the Venom that we all wanted. And that's one of the reasons why I bought this wave. Uh, I said this in a previous video. One of the main reasons why I decided just to buy this entire wave was because of this Venom figure, guys. I think he is that awesome. And the second reason was the rest of the figures. You know, they, they come in second place compared to this Venom. Because he's just really, really on point. Really, really love him. Um, he has some nice weight to him. Um, so let's put him next to the Wave right here. So let's move that out the way. Let's put him, to, let's put him next to the Venom, the Carnage, and then we'll put Poison over here and then scream over here and then we put we'll put them with the rest of the symbiotes and i'll do the comparison the marvel select uh anti-venom comparison um and i'll and i'll show you how he measures up to the uh to the marvel select anti-venom so let's put out and if you guys want to see any reviews of these figures right here off to the side uh please check them out check out my reviews and there he goes. I mean, he's not much bigger than these figures. I mean, of course, you know, Venom is pretty big. There's Carnage. There's Scream. There's Poison. Spider-Man over there. He's not a part of this wave, but I included him. But yeah, he he he's uh, he measures up very, very well with the rest of these figures. He, he kind of, I don't want to say it overshadows them, but yeah, he's definitely way bigger than these figures. Of course, standing next to Venom, right there, he's just monstrous. That's why they call him Monster Venom. So guys, before I give you my uh, review, not my review, but my rating of this figure, I'm gonna go ahead and bring out, the, here's the Marvel Select, guys, and you see how big this Marvel, this uh, Marvel Legend is with the Anti-Venom, guys. This is Marvel Legend, Marvel Select Anti-Venom, and you see how big he is. He's just as big. Actually, he's bigger than the Marvel Select Anti-Venom. That's how big he is. So that shows you. Yeah, that shows you how big this um, Marvel Legend uh, Venom is. I love the details. I love the articulation of this figure. Oh! He's a little bit hard to bend, his hands, but that's only because he's big. I don't really know how I'm going to pose him, but there we go. I kind of like him like that <laughs> because he's showing you his hands and you can see kind of his full body. You know what I mean? So, guys, okay, here we go. I'm going to rate him on a scale from 1 to 10 with 10 being the highest. I'm going to give this Venom... This monster venom, guys, a perfect ten, a perfect solid ten, because he's just that awesome looking. He's just that amazing looking. He's just really, 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 really cool. I really, really like him a lot. I do recommend him. I do recommend this series if you can get this series. You know, if you're not a fan of any of these figures, I understand. But I do like these figures that I, all these figures that I reviewed so far. Um, I think they're all pretty awesome and a pretty cool collection to have, especially with this Venom. I mean, if you're going to get this Venom and you're just going to get this, you're just going to buy these figures just for the build a piece and you're just going to get rid of all these figures, I suggest don't. I suggest keep these figures because they go, they go very, very well with this monster Venom, as you guys can see. I mean, 
yeah, he has like a whole crew of symbiotes. And they go very well with this monstrous Venom guy. I think he's really, really awesome. I give him a perfect 10, guys. I mean, I can't give him anything lower, nor would I want to. I mean, he's just on point. Everything about him is breathtaking and beautiful. Uh, Marvel Legends really knocked, knocked this one out the park, guys. They really did. They really, really did. This is uh, a perfect 10 for this monster Venom. Uh, I don't think they could have done a better, a better job uh, with an action figure uh, than with a, a Build-A-Figure. Uh, you know, with a Build-A-Figure, I think... This Build-A-Figure, I think, is right up there with some of the best Build-A-Figures ever. I think he's one of the best, if not the best... You know, some some would say Apocalypse. You know, the Apocalypse build a figure wave was really good. I do really like that Apocalypse. But this Venom is pretty awesome, guys. I give him a solid 10. So there you guys have it. There was my little review of the Monster Venom from the Monster Venom build a figure wave. Build a figure wave. And he is complete. All the pieces need they go to he goes very well. All the pieces go very, very well together. I love the broad shoulders. I love the big arms. I love the big hands. I love the big spider. I love the big legs, the big feet, the big mouth. Everything about this guy is big. So there you guys have it. If you like this video, hit the like button, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button if you want to receive more cool, awesome reviews like this. And I do mean that this guy is awesome. This guy is breathtaking. Really, really, really breathtaking, guys. I can't stop drooling over this figure. So we just hit the 17-minute mark. And there you guys have it. And I have nothing else more to say other than get him. He's awesome. So there you guys have it. Just want to thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.